Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Long Branch is being brought to you by Ocean First Bank. I'm Mike Frankel in Ocean City for a Group 4 South semifinal clash between the OC Red Raiders and the Long Branch Green Wave. These two teams met in this same round two years ago in Long Branch. It was the Red Raiders coming away with the victory then. Once again, a spot in a sectional title game is up for grabs tonight. The Raider Nation student section is packed and fired up for this one. No score late in the first quarter with OC facing fourth down. Riley Gunnels connects with Mike Gray and the senior tight end muscles his way forward for a Red Raiders first down. The drive would stall after the quarter change, so here's Brendan McGonigal on to attempt a 38-yard field goal. McGonigal's kick is up and good to give Ocean City a three-zip lead. OC with a very short field now after Long Branch tries a fake punt from its own end zone and doesn't convert. Sean Mazzatelli on the carry, and the senior charges in from four yards out. Mazzatelli and company extend the lead 10 to nothing. The green wave looking to answer now. Christian Rodriguez on the move to his right. Fires downfield to Kajan Thorne. Thorne makes the catch and takes it inside the five yard line. First and goal for Long Branch. But the OC defense makes a stand to force a green wave field goal attempt. Wesley Garcia from 22 yards out. That's up and good to get Long Branch on the scoreboard. Under 30 seconds to go before halftime now. OC knocking at the door here. The Raiders fake a couple of handoffs. Who has it? Gunnels as he hits Taylor Eggett at the five and Eggett dives in for the score. A 10 yard toss from Gunnels to Eggett and Ocean City makes it 17 to three at the break. The Raiders receive the kickoff to start the third quarter and march right down the field again. Gunnels rolling to his right, fires to Jack Hogue who makes the catch at the seven yard line. And just a few plays later, it's the junior Gunnels on the keeper. He cuts it back and scoots in from a couple of yards out. Riley Gunnels makes it 24 to three Ocean City. The Green Wave trying to find the end zone for the first time tonight. Rodriguez on the keeper around the right side, stretches for the goal line and he gets there. The senior Rodriguez trying to keep the wave in it. It's a 24 to 10 ball game. But Ocean City marches right back down the field again. It's Mazzatelli through the hole, running right through the contact as he races in for another touchdown. 29 yards on the run from Sean Mazzatelli to make it 31 to 10 Raiders. OC continuing to clamp down on defense as well. Rodriguez doing his best to scramble out of the pressure, but the Red Raiders are swarming. Zach Holt finally gets home for the sack. That's Holt's second sack of the night. Fourth quarter now, OC down to the one yard line after a long run from Gunnels, and he finishes the job with a QB sneak for six. The second rushing score of the night for Riley Gunnels as Ocean City is putting this game away, now up 38 to 10. Long Branch needs points and the Green Wave need him in a hurry. Throwing deep down the field, but Mazzatelli has it covered. Check out the concentration from Sean Mazzatelli to haul in the interception. And OC takes over. Mazzatelli over 100 yards rushing in the contest. Jacob Wilson going over the century mark on the ground as well. And Wilson puts the exclamation point on things right here. The senior Wilson going 37 yards to pay dirt and Ocean City rolls into the sectional championship game. 45 to 10 is your final. The Red Raiders still undefeated on the season as they move to 11 and 0. OC now one win away from its first South Jersey title in more than 20 years. I mean, it all starts up front. You know, you see how dominant the O-line is. You know, we win in the trenches. You know, that's credit to the O-line, Zimaz, CJ Connie, Ed Pierce, Miko. You know, good, and you know they set the tone at the line of scrimmage, and that's why all these running backs are having success. Coach gathered us up in a huddle. Me and Maz, we we talked to each other for like a minute. We were like, we need to ground and pound all game, man. This is our last home game of the season, potentially, man. We just gotta grind out. And second half, even the second quarter, and after that drive, the first drive, we went hard, man. You know, at the end of the day, man, you know we know what we had as a team. You know, the coaches, the players. You know, we knew what we could accomplish. And, just coming together. Second seeded Ocean City will now go on the road to take on top seeded Millville for the Group 4 South Championship next week. Long Branch falls to 7 and 2. The Green Wave get Red Bank Regional on Thanksgiving. In Ocean City, I'm Mike Frankel, JerseySportsZone.com.